I've been getting some sort of feedback that peer proxy IP are not that strong, especially when it is being disconnected. Let's say you were using it and after a while, maybe your phone died. Some people have actually let me know about their concerns that it is not reconnecting. Like that same IP is not getting reconnected that sometimes you have to pick another IP and sometimes if they, are, they can be browsing and the IP will just will not be connecting again and their internet will be down due to that IP unavailability, that it is not that stable. So before, Peer Proxy used to promise us um, for SOX5, they used to promise 24 to 48 hours for Peer Proxy, for SOX5 rather. So for SOX5, they used to promise 24 to 48 hours. But now I recently realized that they've updated it to 12 hours. So what they are saying now is that the longest IP validity is 24 hours. You need to be very careful about that statement they made. You need to get what they are saying. The longest IP validity, which means they, it could be shorter than 12 hours. So they are not even promising you the 24, 20, the 12 hours. They are saying the longest IP validity, like all their IP on this SOX 5 oh, the longest one you can see is 12 hours, which means some of the IPs that you get might not be up to 12 hours. So I think that's why it is quite cheap too. That's why I'm bringing this alternative long acting IPs. Why you can try to use this for some tasks, if you want to do a serious tax and you don't want your server to be done, I think it is be good to actually mix it up. So for this long acting ISP, they are promising you, as you can see the pricing here, yeah, let's first come to the pricing. The pricing is 0.53 IPs and even the minimum you can get is 79.5, which is very high, which is a lot of money. Let's say if you are, to, if you are from Nigeria and you want to buy this, so 0.53 times, let's say one for... 70 for now that's the rate around this period so it's like 707 79 naira per ip and this ip they only promise you that it, it will use 24 hours ip service is available up to 24 hours ensuring that you do not have worry about frequent ip changes during this use so they are promising you that the ip will be stable that's why they call it long lasting ip so but it is how many times more expensive divided by 260 so it is like three times more expensive than the sox5 proxy so that's what i'm recommending that if you just want to perform normal tasks that just normal tasks you can use sox5 proxy and sometimes when you want to per perform serious tasks and you don't want this connection so you can use this long acting high sp based on this the minimum you can get if you have to multiply this by the 150 yeah because the minimum you can get here is 150 ip times 150 you see that you have to spend up to 116,000 naira and it is not everybody that has this kind of money to spend on ip so you can use this the same method that we've been doing by going to rate five just come to rate five right here go to under marketplace and you want to buy peer proxy come to scroll to where you see peer proxy and you see long acting isp so instead of buying 150 IPs, which is the minimum on peer proxy, you can buy five as low as five IPs here. So at the same price, under 780, as you can see here, it is under 780, 779. So you click on buy. So you click on buy and you click on, let's say five. You want to buy five. So with five here, with just 3,900, you can buy just 3,900. Let's, let's try to buy. So this transaction has been placed as you can see here if you come to wallet i have money in my wallet so you see that the 3900 has been moved to my escrow balance this is the balance i have in my available wallet so this is the money for the transaction that i just opened as you can see here on the overview page i have a trade request that has been sent and the countdown is 30 minutes so i'm waiting for the seller to accept my offer so let us refresh. I've gotten a notification that the offer has been accepted. So under it, we see it under this active transaction like that if you refresh. So this is it. Then I'll view. I can say hello. Waiting 
for the CD key. So I'm waiting for the CD key. So as you can see, the CD key has been sent. So I'll say, okay, on it. So let's try to load it. And I'll come on my peer pro, uh, my peer pro account, long acting ISP. And I'll come to this redeem. I'll paste it here and click on confirm. Request too frequent. This issue can come up sometimes. I think what we need to do, try to on a VPN. And I think I have fast VPN right here. Or I can use another browser, but I don't want to use another browser. I'll just use VPN. So let me just connect to this Germany. So it has been connected. So I can try to redeem it again like that. I click on confirm. I see that it has been redeemed. And I have the five IPs now. So since we have been able to redeem it, I'll come here to release the payment. So I'll click on release payment. So OTP has been sent to my email. Let me try to copy the OTP that is being sent to my email. Okay, I've copied the OTP, then I paste it. So it automatically load and transaction has been completed. I've released the payment. So if you go to the wallet now, you see that the money in my escrow would have been released. Yeah, the money has been released to the seller. So I can proceed to use it. If you want to use it, if you want to use it on your laptop, you can follow the tutorial right here. And if you want to use it on phone, that one is quite straightforward. For the Android, use this, and for the iOS, Apple, use this. So once you done, you've downloaded it. So once you log in, you'll be able to connect. So if you don't have to use it on mobile, so watch this video displaying at this top corner of my video. You can do well to check. Thanks for watching. Bye.